Remington Range, 9 mil, 115 grain. Is it any good? Is it any different from the green and white box? <laughs> That's what we'll find out next on GB Guns. If you're new to the series, welcome. We're on the quest to find the best bang for your buck range ammo. We've tested a total of 13 so far, at least as of the filming of this video, with plans for at least 20 common 9mm range loads, looking to see, is it consistent? What's the cost per round? What kind of energy is there? Because some guns, some shooters, need more energy or less muzzle energy. If you look at the pinned comment, you'll find a listing over at gbgunsdepot.com or we've ranked all this stuff tested. You can see standard deviation, which is how consistent is it, the velocity, the energy, and the cross per round of all of these loads to figure out what is best for you. We're doing this by shooting a group through a chronograph, five shots at seven yards. Chronograph's a little wonky. It might decide to read in meters today uh, or feet per second. Not sure. Don't worry. I'll do the conversion using the same pistol every time. Grand Power K100, one that I know I can shoot well, one that I know has a spectacular barrel. It is a four and a quarter inch barrel, so that velocity is likely to be a little bit higher than you would get in a shorter barrel. Just keep that in mind. But it's what I know I can shoot well and the gun I know will perform well. How does Remington range perform and how does it stack up against the UMC green and white box. Is there really a difference? Let's find out. Three twenty nine. It feels softer than the green and white. Three forty two. Three forty. These are meters per second. 333 and 342. Not bad on consistency. I can't do the math in my head. You guys will see that stuff on screen through the wonders of editing. As if I do much editing. <laughs> um, but uh, that shot pretty well. That group, the stringing is sheer error. It's to be expected. I'm human. It's hot. I'm tired. However, uh, that stuff was really comfy. Um, truth be told, I just filmed the green and white box video right before this one, as in it less than five minutes ago, and it felt softer, felt more comfortable. I think this Remington range is something that you could easily spend a whole day on the range with plinking. As far as its consistency and price per round and whether or not that's worth it to you, check out the article over at gbgunsdepot.com. Thanks for watching.